Hey guys, you're watching Boondocking with Dennis. Port Aransas, Texas. I'm on the ferry. I am not on the ferry. I am on the ferry. If you are on the ferry, you do what you want. This is America. You're entitled. No one's going to bother you. Me, my personal choice, in 2022... I'm going to just get on the ferry. I'm okay. <laughs> Man, I don't even want to leave Port Aransas right now. It is gorgeous. The humidity here is only in the 60 percentage, which is low for this area. I know if you're not from this area, you're probably thinking how high that is. It's usually in the 80s, 90s here. It's a, it's a big sweat box. <laughs> I got over here early and went to the beach and uh, saw some ships come in. Not a bad day. I have to change that too. I saw one ship come in. They just weren't bringing them in today. They're lined up out there and uh, something's going on. By the way, haven't said it yet, but front row on the ferry, front row outside left, not bad. I think that's the, uh, the Dolphin Watch ship out there. And hopefully where the Dolphin Watch ship is, there's some dolphins. What do you think? <gasps> Dolphin. I don't know if we got it, but one was real close to us right there. Nice little surprise. That's nice of the dolphins to go where the dolphin watch ship is. It was a good day at the beach. Saw some people doing turtle stuff. Looking for turtles. This is a real good spot to see dolphins. More towards dusk and uh, dawn. But we'll see if we got that one dolphin or not. I'm not sure. Coming over to the other side, heading towards Aransas Pass. It's going to be a good, uh, good ride for us. Made a video driving to here. Made a video down on the beach. I was going to uh, stay on the beach longer, but I got a few errands to run, and uh, I want to come here and just stay overnight on the beach. It's not like I have to be anywhere. You guys know I love rusty stuff, right? There's rusty stuff. A lot of rusty stuff. Over there is the uh, parts of wind turbines. They got stacked up over there. They'll, uh, they'll unload them from the uh, ship. Woo! Roller coaster of love. You know, it was smooth sailing over here. Why, why is it going up and down? Why are, we, why are we going up and down? Someone's playing musical cars over there. Now, we used to call that back in the day. Ooh. We used to call that running into stuff. But um, we used to call that a Chinese fire drill. That, that's got to be politically incorrect now. I wonder what you call that now. We'd pull up to a red light, and then we would all switch seats. Four people, five people, six people would all get out and run around the car, and then get back in a different seat, just to see the looks on the, uh, the people behind us, the looks on their faces. Why that would be a Chinese fire drill is beyond me. Sorry, China. You know what my number, other than the United States, my uh, the most watches I get were always Canada. Start the truck up. Truck started. That's a good sign. And uh, now number three is Australia. Go. We're going. We got the nod. 
Number three is Australia. And number two is Nicaragua. I don't know what what is going on with that. I don't remember getting any comments from Nicaragua. I guess I have to be very careful how I say that. But if you're watching from Nicaragua, thank you very much. Probably lost my uh, Chinese audience with that uh, Chinese fire drill joke. It's got to be called, why, why can't it just be called a fire drill? <laughs> I mean, the Chinese are pretty organized. So, maybe that's it. Maybe we were so organized it was a Chinese fire drill. I'll just keep saying it until YouTube gets enough racist uh, reports and pulls my channel. Can you imagine that? All the dumb things I've said and... I've, if I got taken out for Chinese fire drill, I don't care. I'd still eat Chinese food. I would eat Chinese food during a Chinese fire drill if I had to. Wouldn't phase me a bit. Oh, it's just gorgeous. It's funny. I'm, I'm usually sad when I leave the beach, but I'm just going to a different beach, right? going to uh, give my one friend a ride and well and then give my other friend a ride two people need rides and apparently I have the only vehicle in South Texas so that's me but you know what these people are both friends and they both help me so boo hoo poor me I'll spend the rest of the day at Rockport Beach instead of Port Aransas Beach I just hope there's a nap involved. Naps are good. I did not take the time to ask Siri for a horrible, horrible joke. What's what's black and white, black and white, and black and white? A nun falling down the stairs. There you go. There go all the Catholics. I lost the Chinese today. I lost the Catholics. I'm just I'm just grateful to have fans and uh, fans subscribers in Nicaragua. Now I'm going to have to read up on Nicaragua. I don't know anything about Nicaragua, except that it's probably hot there. As hot as it gets here. I can't imagine being even closer to the equator. It's got to be pretty brutal. The people that have lived here their whole lives, I, I never hear them talk about how hot it is. <laughs> I'd like to get them up to Maine and Pennsylvania where I grew up and see how long they last. <laughs> The water is that special color today. The sun is shining. Everything. Everything gonna be alright this morning. Oh yeah. I did not even go into Wally World this morning. I haven't been indoors yet. And I think I'm gonna try to keep it that way. I'll tell you what I did eat. I was looking at my apps while I was uh, uploading. Because I, I was deleting apps. I'm like, I haven't used this. I haven't used this. And I looked at my Whataburger app on my phone. And I was like, I haven't used this in a very long time. Maybe I'll delete it. And I looked and I had money on my account. So I got uh, a Bob breakfast on a bun, sausage, egg, and cheese with hash browns and a coffee. And it was like seven something. I will swear the last time I bought that, 
it was under five bucks. And my favorite thing for breakfast from Whataburger is uh, the jalapeno um, sausage, egg, and cheese on a jalapeno biscuit. And I was told they don't carry that anymore. It's not even on the menu. So Whataburger sold to a company outside of Texas. And now you don't have that. I hate to say this. I, I'll fear for my safety because I'm still in Texas. But screw you, Whataburger. Screw you. I'm done with you. Me and you, we're done. And by the way, if you're new to the channel... I'm fat. We're talking some serious money here. <laughs> well, guys, we're coming up on Aransas Pass. I appreciate you all hanging out with me. Thanks for riding along. Cracking the windshield. Gorgeous day. Thanks for watching.